welcome back to my watercolor channel today i paint some daisies which is a very fast and easy painting i'll show you how to draw them so i draw a small circle which is oval shaped and around as well an oval shaped circle then i add some lines which are in the form of curves and in different direction whereby the circle serves basically as a guideline then i continue to draw more daisies so remember to add different sizes and as well in different directions but basically i proceed the same way as i have done at the first one before so here i have a very fast drawing and i fast forward it a little bit because it takes the most time in this painting and i believe it is the most challenging part then i add the petals at the end so kind of different sizes and as well in different directions some of the days is a little bit more open some are still a little bit closed but it is very important to have a variety in it so it makes the painting look much more lively and much more organic here some more of those flowers more closed daisies and more petals but not too many so that the painting doesn't look too overcrowded then I erase the guidelines and then I put some masking fluid at the flowers as they are supposed to remain quite white. Uh, the colors that I use are orange which is mixed out of deep yellow and rose madden as well as some purple which is out of phthalo blue and rose madden and then I used phthalo blue and lemon yellow to make some greenish colors. So I start with the deep yellow and then I add some rose madden at the top of the painting. I have not wetted the paper before, which I usually do, but I thought I wanted to have much stronger colors. And then I'm adding more and more of the orange. And then halfway through, especially where the daisies begin, I add more of the purple colors. And the colors are flowing downwards as painting is tilted and here you can see big splashes as well of the bluish color phthalo blue and then adding finally some of the green which is a little bit darker and spreading everything with a very big brush and then adding lighter green we added more of the lemon yellow and then some more of the blue so kind of like a very a little bit between the colors but i add the dark colors at the bottom of the painting especially where the daisies are because i really want them to stand out from the background and then splashing a little bit here of the orange as well uh, the paper is still quite wet but if there are some of the water stains it really does not matter because it's more of abstract then adding more of those stems for the flowers i just use with some light brush strokes so not putting that much effort and here and there as well in different directions as it would be in the nature but then after everything has dried, I remove the masking fluid and I add some of the deep yellow to the center of the flowers. So here and then a little bit at the bottom and then more here as well. Basically covering all 
the centers of the flowers and then adding the same orange that I used for the painting uh, at the top to the middle of the daisies so it has a little bit of a contrast and creates more of a balance goes very quickly and some flowers some centers of the flowers have already dried and then here a little bit and we are nearly done <laughs> just adding more of a darker colors to the stems as well as a little bit more stronger grass which is uh, a little bit sharper and to have a contrast to the background so not everything is very blurry and then really emphasizing the whiteness of the daisies so the queen is basically just a color blue and some lemon yellow the daisies really remind me of the summer so i always look forward to see them especially as the winters here in the northern finland are quite long they're very common the flowers but i still really like and appreciate them and onto the petals I add a some thalo blue of a very light layer so just to emphasize a little bit the different petals but not too much that's basically the last step so it really has to be very very light because the whiteness of the daisy should shine through okay now we're done thank you for watching and i hope you enjoyed it remember to subscribe bye